Catholic Biblical Federation, Sister Marie Emmanuel Gunanto Ursuline, representing Angela Mirici Biblical Center, Indonesia. What is the CBF for me? A big international family of brothers and sisters gathered around the living word, drawing and sharing life from it, growing together in love for God and humankind, proclaiming the good news to the world. Angela Mirici Biblical Center was founded on the 27th of January 1989 and became a CBF member in that same year. Our activities are Bible course based on the Bible in a hundred weeks by Marcel Ledors for adults from various parishes in Bandung and Ursuline novices. Weekly biblical animation for one parish. Monthly biblical animation for contemplative Carmelite sisters and for the blind. Publishing a monthly reflections on the readings of daily mass. Biblical retreats to various groups on request. Seminars on bibliodrama and creative ways in teaching the Bible coordinating the Biblical Pastoral Ministry in the Diocese of Bandung from 1987 to 2002, coordinating CBF Southeast Asia from 1996 to 2017, organizing six CBF Southeast Asian workshops and exchange of experts throughout the sub-region. During this pandemic period, weekly Bible course for Ursuline novices, weekly Bible course through YouTube, weekly biblical animation through Zoom for various groups. Coordinating CBF Southeast Asia from 1996 to 2017. During the plenary assembly in Hong Kong, in 1996, I was appointed coordinator of CBF Southeast Asia. Considering the vastness of the CBF subregion, the Philippines, Indonesia, Myanmar, Malaysia, Singapore, Vietnam, Cambodia, Laos, Thailand, with seven full members and 18 associate members, I immediately formed a coordinating team with two friends from the Philippines. Father Dominado Ramos SVD or Father Doms as Secretary and Miss Estrella Del Mar Star as Treasurer. There has been a wonderful teamwork, team spirit and friendship among the three of us during our service from 1996 to 2017, that is 21 years. Our priority was promoting communication among the C members, strengthening a sense of belonging and encouraging full participation of each member with the Federation. For that purpose, I wrote many personal letters to each member to know their strengths and needs, making sure that they make their annual reports and pay their annual fees to the treasurer. Father Doms provided us with a website where we could share our passion for the word, our ideas, common efforts, preparation for the General Assembly, etc., linking all the members of Southeast Asia and the whole world. Our Southeast Asian members are not rich. Some pay less than the required amount. STAR has a wonderful way to make the money grow so that we could finance, among others, our six CBF Southeast Asian workshops held in various member countries. Word a farewell after our seventh CBF Southeast Asian workshop in Natrang. From the seventh CBF Southeast Asian workshop in Natrang, Vietnam, 
We, your coordinating team, after serving for 21 years, say goodbye to you, not with sadness or regret, but with a grateful heart. It is the Lord who brought us together in this vast sub-region. We have been working together in good times and bad times, inspiring each other in living and spreading the word of life. Some said that our sub-region is most active and alive. We don't know whether that is true, but we pray that our sub-region under the banner of Dr. Natividad Pagadut, the new coordinator, may grow and with great zeal proclaim the good news to our people in this modern world. Let us remain united in him, our Lord Jesus Christ, yours in the word, Star, Doms, and Emma.